Russia reports nuclear explosions hit vast U.S. military tunnel network. A frightening foreign military intelligence director at GRU report circulating in the Kremlin today states that over the past nearly 36 hours the vast intercontinental military tunnel complex constructed by the United States Air Force over the past nearly 45 years was hit with two powerful nuclear explosions at its main terminuses in Colorado and Virginia used nearly exclusively by the Central Intelligence Agency CIA. According to this report, this unprecedented nuclear attack began on the evening of 22 August when one of the main air pressure relief tunnels for the CIA tunnel, located at MacDill Air Force Base in Tampa, Florida, was forced open allowing millions of cubic feet of air to rush suddenly into the atmosphere. The unique sound of this event was captured by video a third video during a baseball game being played at Tropicana Field near MacDill, though U.S. officials blamed the mystery noise on a faulty sound system. This GRU report, however, points out that Russian engineers are well acquainted with this unique sound as they work feverishly to prepare an additional 5,000 bomb shelters ordered by Prime Minister Putin this past spring to be completed by the end of 2012. Russian engineers were, also, able to duplicate this unique sound this past March when they were called into the Ukraine to vent a number of deep underground tunnels from poison gas that had killed three people near Kiev and which was, likewise, captured by video. Video below the most detailed video of these horrific sounds is from Ukraine, Kiev these bizarre sounds were also heard in Belarus the sounds were also heard in America people from Canada, Lithuania and Scotland have also reported these strange sounds. Within a few hours of the venting of this vast tunnel complex, this report continues, a nuclear device was detonated at its western terminus located near Trinidad, Colorado with the second blast occurring nearly 12 hours later at the eastern terminus near Culpeper, Virginia, and both causing powerful earthquakes felt by tens of millions of Americans. Unbeknownst to the vast majority of the American people is that the vast military tunnel network constructed since the early 1960s under their country has cost an estimated $40 trillion and with the exception of this attack shows no sign of abating. The only known photo of one of the massive U.S. Air Force boring machines used to construct this vast tunnel complex was taken by Little Skull Mountain in Nevada in December 1982 top right photo and is similar in design to those used to construct the tunnel between England and France. Maps of these tunnels, and the underground bases associated with them, have been compiled over the years by many independent researchers along with lists of their probable locations. The specific tunnel attacked by these nuclear devices, this GRU report says, was being used by the CIA during their moving of their headquarters and all of their assets out of their Langley, Virginia location to their new base located in Denver, Colorado that was begun in 2005 for reasons still not fully explained. The GRU speculates that the timing of this attack in hitting the western terminus first, then the eastern one, was more than likely meant to trap and destroy whatever the CIA was currently moving through this tunnel from Langley to Denver. Most interesting to note is that this attack comes nearly a decade to the day after the September 11, 2011 internal war between the CIA and the U.S. military establishment that rained destruction upon America, and then the world, but whose final battle has yet to be fought, or won, by either side. To what the final outcome of this titanic struggle will be it is not in our knowing, other than to note that when two powerful forces like these collide, and as they have done so many times in the past, the ultimate losers end up being the American people whose delight and total ignorance as to what is happening around them continues to astound the whole world. Hey everyone, I'm Angela Sun. Welcome to the Yahoo Sports Minute. The old saying goes, you see something new every time you go to the ballpark. In the case of Monday night at Tropicana Field, fans heard something new, and it was a little scary. That's a haunting sound, if we've ever heard one. And what could that possibly be? Somebody shut the door. Of course.